Hello, Abby. My name's Amy. Would it be okay if I examine you? Yes. Inspect the neck from the front, looking for a goiter. Could I ask you to confirm your name and address? The voice can be characteristic in severe hypothyroidism. Please, could you hold your hands out for me? Look for fine tremor and feel for sweating, which may occur in hyperthyroidism. Carpal tunnel syndrome can complicate myxedema, and you may see hand changes of thyroid acropachy. Assess pulse rate, rhythm and volume. Tachycardia and atrial fibrillation can be features of thyrotoxicosis. Keeping your chin still, could you look at my finger and follow it down? Check for lid lag. You may need to give a bigger target if the patient's vision is poor. Look for proptosis, best seen from above. The thyroid or a thyroid mass moves up on swallowing. Supply water for the patient to sip in order to demonstrate this. Please could you take a sip of the water? Observe the neck from the front during swallowing. I'm gently going to examine your neck. Stand behind the patient and gently feel the regions of the thyroid gland. Then place your hands over the gland with the index fingers just touching. Could you take a sip of water for me, please? Feel the gland as it moves up and then back down during swallowing. Thank you. Note the size, shape and consistency of any goiter and feel for a thrill. Listen over the two major lobes for a bruit. If there is a large goiter, use a tape measure and record the maximum neck circumference. Lastly, look at the lower limbs for pretibial myxedema. Thank you.